nine Liverpool stars out on loan in EFL, and how they fared including two promotions. Liverpool still have their sights set on a historic quadruple this term. Despite the blip at the weekend, after dropping points against Tottenham, they are still in with a shout of lifting the Premier League title. An FA Cup final and Champions League final, against Chelsea and Real Madrid respectively, are still to come, and they of course already have the Carabao Cup in the bag. It promises to be a potentially memorable campaign for Jurgen Klopp's side. And whilst the focus at Anfield is firmly on this season, it will not be long before next term comes around. To that end, the futures of a number of Liverpool players is likely to be decided in the coming weeks with a number having spells out in the EFL. Here, Mirror Football runs the rule over those players and how they have got on away from Liverpool this year. Welsh international defender Williams was dispatched to championship side Fulham on January transfer deadline day. And the move could not have really gone any better. Williams featured 14 times for the Cottagers and scored two goals, including a goal of the season contender, as they romped to the second-tier title. Reflecting on a profitable second half of the season, Williams said, I've improved as a player and getting promoted is a nice one to put on the CV. I have gained a lot of experience in a short amount of time. I've gone from starting a Champions League game against AC Milan and beating them 2-1 to playing Barnsley. So I have gained quite a lot of valuable and varied experience at such a young age. Williams signed a five-year contract back in 2020, but his development next season will be intriguing to witness. Phillips came to the fore during Liverpool's troubled title defence last season, but the return to fitness of a number of centre-halves pushed him back down the pecking order this term. After making just three appearances in the first half of the season, the 25-year-old was sent out on loan to Bournemouth in January. And like Williams he will be returning to Anfield with a promotion under his belt. He made 17 league appearances and played his part in helping Scott Parker's side seal a top-flight return after a two-year absence. Before his loan move to the South Coast, Phillips was linked with a string of Premier League clubs, and with his contract running until 2025 the Reds have ensured they will not lose the centre half on the cheap if they choose to sell this summer. Williams, like Phillips, enjoyed a breakthrough 2020-21 season making 19 appearances that term. The start of this season saw him make an expected move out on loan, with Swansea City his end destination. On paper, the move looked ideal with the passing philosophies of Russell Martin's side looking a good fit. But it turned into a disaster. Williams played just seven games, making only four starts in the championship, and the move was cut short in January. Williams posted shortly after confirmation, writing, gutted it didn't go to plan, but it's been a pleasure to be a swan for the time I was given. He has not made a senior appearance since returning to Anfield, but is under contract until 2026. Another player who saw a season-long loan move cut short halfway through. Fielder Clarkson joined his hometown club Blackburn at the start of the season. It seemed an exciting move for the 20-year-old, but he would feature just seven times, failing to figure after mid-November until his January recall. He sent a classy message despite the agreement ending early, writing, Although it hasn't gone to plan I would like to thank all the players, all the staff, and the fans for making me feel at home. I would love to wish the club all the best for the future and keep striving for promotion. Now time to get back to at Liverpool can work harder than ever. Clarkson has not made a senior squad since returning to his parent club, but is under contract long term. Dutch defender Van den Berg has enjoyed a solid campaign at Preston North End, his second temporary stay at Deepdale. His decision to return has proved wise with him making 50 appearances this term. One of those famously came against his parent club back in October, when Liverpool gave permission for him to feature against them in an EFL Cup tie. His deal at Anfield runs until 2024 and speaking recently he said the Reds can expect a different player when he returns in the summer. When I came to Liverpool I was 17, and I'm 20 now, so it has been a hell of a few years. But yeah, of course they are going to see a different player to the one that left. The transfer of Davies from Preston to Anfield back in early 2021 remains a head-scratcher to everyone apart from those privy to the deal. Admittedly the Reds needed cover at centre-half after a glut of injuries there. But Davies never made an appearance and was subsequently shipped out for the 2021-22 campaign to Sheffield United. He has enjoyed an up-and-down season at Bramall Lane, making 23 outings as United posted a fifth-placed finish. Davies will be looking to end on a high by helping the Blades successfully negotiate the playoffs before he embarks on a far-from-certain summer back at Liverpool. Winger Oho was sent out to Millwall 
the seventh separate loan spell of his Anfield career. Still only 24, Ojo has made 19 outings for playoff chasing Millwall, although only 12 of those were championship starts. A two-month layoff at the start of 2022 did not help his cause, and he struggled to get back into the team after his return. Ojo has only ever made eight league appearances for Liverpool, but his contract still has another season to run after this. Young midfielder Kane made 28 outings in all competitions during a season-long stay at League Two side Newport County. The 20-year-old is under contract long-term on Merseyside, but will have benefited greatly from a full season in the fourth tier. Despite not being able to aid the exiles in their push for a playoff spot, Kane has clearly contributed to the cause and has adopted certain new elements to his game according to Newport boss James Roberry. There is a natural ability to Jake with his technical ability, his tactical ability and understanding of the game. What he has started to do is add the horrible side of the game, the cliché of earning the right to play. Striker Glatzel scored six goals in 21 games for Tranmere Rovers before his season was cruelly curtailed in March. The 21-year-old suffered a hamstring injury that ruled him out of the run-in and prevented him from boosting Rovers' ultimately unsuccessful chase for the playoffs. Glatzel was once highly rated by Klopp, but has endured a torrid time with injuries in recent years and will hope for an injury-free run to get his career back on track.